it's tough for me to think that this isn't Mahomes' moment. That this is this is the one right here, year two. He's he's got him here, and uh, and he's just going to meet this moment. And I'm I, yeah. and that's why I'm leaning Chiefs right now. I'm wondering what you think well, of that whole well, idea. I mean, here's the beautiful thing: is that we've seen that scenario play out many times, right? The guy that everybody's talking about, you know, the main man for one of the teams, comes into the Super Bowl and he shines in this moment, mm -hmm. walks away with the MVP, and it happens. But we've also seen the other side of it, like the guy that nobody expected. Right. You know, the guy that, you know, we weren't even talking about all week, comes in and has his moment in the Super Bowl as well. And so would I be surprised if Patrick Mahomes of not, came right. out of this game and had the MVP and all that? No. But I look at the other side, and I look at a guy like Raheem Moster, and I say to myself, that was me 20 years ago, right? That cut by seven teams, has his moment to help his team get here. And then that would be a beautiful story, too, is that on the biggest stage in the biggest moment, the guy that was told seven times, you're not good enough, you can't be here, you're never going to make it, has his shining moment, too. So I just that's what I love about it, is you don't know what the story is going to be written on Super Bowl Sunday, and I could see so many things play out, uh, and that's what excites me is, it, will it be, you know, the guy that catapults himself into the next great quarterback, or will it be some unknown guy that wins the MVP and, you know, puts his, it makes a stamp in history um, in this biggest game, in the biggest game of his career. For more of the Rich Eisen Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV for free on BR Live, or download the Rich Eisen Show app.